I am Dato Sanamal Osman. You can see the main video in the YouTube by typing Dato Sanamal Osman. The topic, the title is uh, Mental Revolution. I dedicate this to all mothers with young children. I have a son, one year old. The speaker said that it is a, it's a trust by God that I have this child. And uh, once before I had a miscarriage and I prayed to God, give me another child. And true enough, now my child is very healthy, one year old. I and my husband are responsible 100% for his upbringing. The speaker said just now that, he, the speaker said in this video that we are the first and most important teachers for the child. From now, he's one year old, we are going to talk and talk with him. And once he can, he's a bit older, we are going to read books for him in our natural language, in, our, in, in English. And we are going to talk about science. We are going to talk about the world. We, got to, we are going to talk about things from the newspaper, from anything. Because the speaker said that our child, from the age of one, one week until seven years old, he is a genius. So if he's a genius, he can absorb so much of knowledge, we are going to expose to him as much knowledge as possible and uh, talk to him in so many languages, in, in English and our natural language. And we are going to bring him to the library every Sunday and borrow books and discuss with him and praise him. We are very good, very good, praise him, give him the confidence. We are responsible for his whole upbringing and we don't want him to feel inferior because he is lacking in knowledge. And the moment he goes to school, we are going to take interest in his, uh, in his, uh, in his work, we are going to see his teachers and we are going to pay so much of attention on his education. So, I, we have three uh, choices. One, to be just ordinary, let him read uh, whatever you want to read, let him, uh, let him see the cartoons every day, let him play with the gadget, and number, number third, the second choice is to scold him. Every little mistake he makes, he scold him and talk harshly with him. No, this is no good, this is no good. The only choice is to go up and it is difficult. It is, takes effort. It takes effort for us to be the best parents that we can be. Not the best parents in the world, but the best parents we can be to expose him to so many things, so, so many subjects, so that when he goes to school at the age of seven, he will be full of confidence. And we are going to talk to him that when he goes to uh, school, he must not believe whatever uh, marks that he gets, which, which are low. He, he can do better. So, uh, I, I'm, we're going to talk to him every night, every time there's a, there's an opportunity, and so that he will have the, develop the self-confidence. To any child, the self-confidence is very, very important. What he thinks about himself or herself, very, very important. And to feel that he has the ability to read as many uh, books as possible and to do well in his studies. He can, uh, what you call, do well in STEM, science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, and in, in the other languages. Yeah. So uh, we are going to play our part the best possible way as parents. Thank you very much.